this uh, Monday, the uh, 29th day of February 2016, Leap Year Day, and today I went out and I uh, went up to, was it Raymond, New Hampshire, to take and uh, visit my uh, high school best friend, you know, was it who is retired, who is also himself retired on SSDI early. And he is like only like about three weeks younger than I am, you know, as, it, as far as age wise. You know, but he graduated the year after me, you know, as it, so, you know, both of us have different graduation years from high school. You know, that uh, at his house, he put in a, uh, well, his house trailer, you know, that he had uh, put in a uh, wheelchair ramp, you know, was it for his, uh, well, for his wife, you know, because uh, she did, uh, she's losing her mobility, you know, that uh, due to, was it, a lot of medical problems. You know that, and the question is, you know, I get, I get uh, asked a lot, you know, that, you know, about what the issues of uh, persons on the autism spectrum and making friends. And the answer to that question is yes, I have many friends. My high school uh, best friend who lives in Raymond, and the many. Uh, Friends I have in the autism and the cerebral palsy disability communities, and also was it uh, I have uh, many uh, friend contacts online in the uh, disability community, you know, which I try to keep up with as best I can. And of course, was it. You know, that uh, this evening, you know, just like about for like uh, two and a half hours was it uh, this morning, you know, as I was just uh, quietly sitting on my adult plastic pail as a uh, adult hospital medical potty chair just to be diaperless for a while, you know, which helps with, uh, you know, issues with uh, skin breakdown, you know, from being in uh, wet, wet and or uh, messy diapers for too long, you know, that, and of course with it, the, uh, the diapers I wear are the uh, Walgreens uh, house brand Certainty adult diapers that come with it. Uh, with it, uh, eighteen dollars for a package of uh, twenty-eight, which isn't too bad, but you know the diapers do not hold that much. And of course, uh, yesterday I did uh, attend worship at my church, so that was important. And I also took a long nap yesterday. Of course, today I did not take a uh, any any nap. And of course, I was watching the evening uh, national news on. Uh, WCVB uh, TV uh, Channel 5 out of uh, Needham, Massachusetts. You know, that uh, just the usual was it uh, political garbage, you know, that uh, let's see, 
the Time Magazine news reporter was it had the living had the living shit beating out of him was it by Secret Service agents you know that uh, you know and of course uh, Donald Trump cheering him on not surprised of course we remember was it Adolf Hitler had was it uh, reporters and photographers, uh, you know, uh, who were, you know, who were trying to cover him, you know, as it were more was it like the opposition, you know, that of course there was a uh, pro, there were protesters there, you know, the, the Black Lives Matter, but I also want to make a note that also Disabled Lives Matter too. Because coming up next weekend, I've got to be at the uh, annual uh, day of mourning vigil for the adults and children with disabilities who have been abused and murdered by their parents and caregivers over the years, which is another important, uh, you know, is it, uh, so essentially it's a, both a uh, vi both a memorial vigil and a protest rally. I'm not going to say where it is, was it? But you know, but I just have to, as a uh, person with autism and cerebral palsy, with uh, both lifelong de physical and developmental disabilities, I have to be there. You know, as a, as a uh, disability civil rights activist. And of course, with it, the uh, well, anyway, not much else is happening. And of course, I did make sure I fed my uh, pet guinea pig Ernie again, so he has plenty of food for the rest of the evening. And I'll just sign off right now. <laughs>